Hey guys, welcome to another night of Morphologists. Tonight, I'm going to be talking to you about how to be an effective medic. But first, I want to lay down some ground rules. I am not going to be telling you how to be an amazing first-person shooter. That is to say, I'm not going to tell you how to get headshots, how to be a freaking Rambo. That is not what this video is about. What this video is about is telling you exactly what it takes to be an effective medic in a platoon. I've created this video with the intention of helping out my own outfit and new players figure out exactly what it takes to be what I describe as an effective meta. So what does this mean? This means that you are playing an active role in helping your platoon move forward to the objective. That doesn't necessarily mean that you're getting a lot of kills. Kill death ratio and being an effective medic don't necessarily have to be related. This means that one effective medic in a larger platoon can make the difference between winning or losing a point. Your job is very simple. Stick with and behind your teammates at all time. The reason why this is important is because when you've got things like maxes, which are extremely expensive for resources, you have to have a way to get them back up again and back in the fight. If you've got no medics, guess what happens? All your maxes are dead and you can no longer push the front line forward. Another very likely scenario when you're playing team-based Planet Side 2 is that once you get on the point, it may happen that you have no way to spawn back once you die. So if you don't have medics, then you can no longer hold the point. This is again where having a medic and not having a medic can very well affect the outcome of a match or alert. Now, I know many of you may object to playing medic because of its supportive nature and lack of general kills, but hands down, the medic is probably the best class to start with to farm your certs to level up your other classes. So then the next logical question is, what should I upgrade first? Well, let's go over it. First, in your character selection screen, go to Medical Applicator. Once inside there, you will see an option to upgrade it. This is the first thing you want to upgrade, as it will help you heal people much faster. This is especially important for healing maxes, which take a much longer time than regular players. Second, let's talk about the type of grenades. You are going to default as an explosive grenade. This is not what you want. You want to cert out the Nanite Revive Grenade. It has the ability to revive a group of players within a given area simultaneously, effective on a point where you need to revive people quickly. Let's now talk about your special ability, the Nano Regen Device, which heals players around you as well as yourself. The next item is your armor. Many people will choose Grenade Bandolier. Personally, I prefer the Nano Armor for durability, especially for those moments when you find yourself on the front line taking fire. Finally, let's talk about your primary weapon. Now, this is more about your own personal preference, but personally, I prefer the HV45, which is only 250 certs to purchase and is an extremely powerful weapon. Definitely worth the purchase. With this incredible rate of fire and high damage rate, it easily becomes one of the most powerful infantry weapons available. Lastly, an ability I did not talk much about is the triage ability. This allows any player who enters your vehicle to be slowly healed. This can be effective for several platoon situations, but I will go over that in another video. So let's go over and review. First, stick with your squad. Second, pay attention to dead teammates at all times. Three, don't be a Rambo. That's not what Medic's about. Four, follow listed cert path in the video. And finally, guys, have fun. This has been a Morphologist instructional video. Thanks, guys, for watching. If you'd like to see more, or if you'd just like to play Planetside with me, check me out on the Connery server and subscribe and comment to my channel. Thanks again, guys, and I'll see you Planetside.